What's up guys? Welcome to the Grid Iron Blitz. My name is Derek P. Fields. Thank you so much for clicking on this video. Today we're going to revisit a topic. Malcolm Brown. Turns out that the Lions offered him a contract two years at $3.25 million. Now the question that I have for Detroit Lions fans is will the Rams match the offer that was offered by Detroit? Now we know that there is no compensatory pick the question is, will they do it? Now, here's why I don't believe they will. They will match the offer, they being the Rams, obviously. And we talked about this last night on the Roundtable podcast. The Rams have just signed Clay Matthews. So you guys get a double dose of free agency news here. If you didn't already know, which you probably did, the Rams have just signed Clay Matthews to a two-year deal with a max of $16.75 million. So with that being said, I'm not sure how much cap space the Rams have left, but spending that much money on a 32-year-old linebacker tells me that Malcolm Brown is going to be the odd man out in that situation. Now, the Rams could try to come in and stifle this whole offer. So we've looked at a couple of running backs. I've even mentioned a few myself with Isaiah Crowell being one of those guys that I thought that they might take a look at. But I think based off what the Lions are trying to do, Crowell might be a little too expensive for them. So Malcolm Brown, as I pointed out in my last video, his contract it was very minimal for the 2018 season. So he shouldn't be much of a risk for the Detroit Lions. I like the pick. Now the question becomes, will Theo Riddick stay on the roster and will the Lions draft a running back this coming draft? So guys, thank you so much for watching the Grid Iron Blitz. I am Derek P. Fields. Be sure to give this video a thumbs up. Helps me out tremendously. I hope you guys are enjoying the content and I will talk to you later. I'm out. Peace.